Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the vlog day 22. Oh my God, is it 22? I don't know about you, but I'm feeling good job. Hi, if you're new here, welcome. My name is Emily. I am 27 years old. I live in New York City, but right now I'm on tour around the country with a children's tour. And right now I'm in Indianapolis, Indiana. Hi, how are you? Welcome to Vlogtober, day 22. It is a Sunday, which is basically our Friday. <laughs> basically our Friday, which means we have off tomorrow, thank God, and Tuesday. And we're ready to take on this Sunday. Um, we went to the symphony last night. It was so much fun, so cool. Definitely one of the highlights of tour. But then we went home and had pizza all together in the lobby. Also, I'm a little uh, not feeling too great this morning. So <laughs> it also looks like there's a game today, an Indiana game. There's a lot of uh, football people out and about. But anyway, I don't have too much time because I did not edit or post the vlog from yesterday because I've been busy. So I have to go downstairs and do that. But. Every day for Vlogtober, we are choosing a tarot card to see what our day is gonna look like. So let's do that, shall we? Gotta get a move on with these. How are you doing? How was your How was your weekend? I should ask because it's it's probably your guys's weekend. So how was your weekend? Did you do anything? Did you get up to anything good? Let me know in the comments. I want to know. Oh, oh. Let's do this one. We've got Page of Cups. I don't know what page is. Let's see, I haven't seen that before. Page of Cups. Oh, is it like a jack? I guess so, because it goes page, queen, king. Okay, there's a serendipity and magic here. Like the breath of love or a very first kiss, anything is possible at this time. Be open to wildly wonderful miracles. This is the when pigs fly card and holding it in your hands is a sign that unforeseen yet fortuitous events are coming your way. Bring childlike enthusiasm to the unknown and welcome any unexpected twist on your journey. Be open to inspiration from the strangest of places and pay attention to the intuitive musings that arrive. They will give your creativity wings. As you enjoy this time of strangely unique thinking, ensure that you are not being overly sensitive or blocking your own flow because you are trying to control the process. Allow your emotions to follow the breadcrumbs of joy. Play a little more. Do something silly. Stay curious about any feelings of wonder and awe and allow your sensitive dreamer to dream. The world is my flourishing oyster and I'm excited to see what happens next. Oh, how sweet. It does have a pig flying on this card. So when pigs fly. Okay, I love that. Where did I put the cap? Hello over here. All right, I am gonna go downstairs, get a cup of coffee and start working on yesterday's vlog because I'm running a little behind. <laughs> All right, I'll talk to you soon. Hello. We just finished show one. I am editing the vlog. This is the latest I've edited. It's 1.30 p.m. and it's not posted, obviously, because I'm still editing, but that's okay. I'm taking the break in between shows to do that. I ate some big chips and an Uncrustable for lunch. And I'm sitting in this huge abandoned store by myself. Just getting some work done, you know? And that's the update for you. We only have one more show today. And it's early, so we're gonna be out early, which is so nice. And then I know there was talks of, so when we went to the haunted house last week, there was like six attractions and we didn't get to do the cornfield because it was uh, too wet and like muddy. But we're thinking about going back today to finish it out. So hopefully that happens. If not, we'll just have a chill evening. And I'm all for that too. All right, I gotta get back to this. Hello everyone, I realize I haven't updated the vlog a second because I really haven't done anything. I came home, I ripped off all of my nails and redid them because they were getting too long and I just want to save the money and not have dip for a while. So these look awful, but you got to do what you got to do. I'm just sitting here watching the tripod and playing some Stardew. So that's the update. We are going to go back to the corn maze tonight though. So that should be fun. All right. I'm going to chill for a little bit longer. <laughs> Hi friends. <laughs> it is about 8 p.m. Um, we're going to head out soon to go to corn maze. And yeah, I haven't, you haven't missed anything. I thought I would give you a little fit check. Why the heck not? We've got 
my Nike or my New Balances. I got these New Balances right when I started this contract, like when we went to LA, right before then, and that was in May. And they are pretty worn up. So I really, really want a new pair. I'll probably do that when I'm home before I go to LA again. And then I've got my Fabletics leggings I've had for, I think my mom got the, these for Christmas one year, a long time ago. Like I think my freshman year of college and they're still holding up. They don't make them like these anymore. They're so good. And then I've got a turtleneck underneath my Halloween Town University sweatshirt. I've got the puffer vest. Of course, it's supposed to be really, really cold. And then I got this um, hatted urban. Fit check. I really don't know. I really don't know what the vibes are gonna be tonight because we only have one thing to do. And I felt like it didn't take long to do like the five other things. So I feel like this is gonna go by really quick. So I don't know if we'll like hang out tonight or what, but I'm honestly excited to be doing something because I think that's something I miss um, a lot. I miss hanging out with people, you know, that's not work. Um, I think tomorrow morning, I'm finally gonna go back to that coffee shop that wasn't open for the whole weekend. So I'll go there tomorrow morning and probably edit, get some work done, um, prepare for November because I wanna do a November reset, like I said before. Another thing that I can't live without recently is this Lulu bag. I was weary, is that the right word, of getting it because um, it's not cheap. Well, it's really not that bad. I think it was probably like 30 bucks, but I use it. I really can't get on this. This is embarrassing, hold on. There we go. I really can't, I don't go anywhere without it. It's so great. I love it so much. Those are my recommendations. Let's get spooked. <laughs> Surprise, surprise, I did not close out the vlog last night. Let's put you over here. There we go. It's my day off, so I slept in a little bit. Oh my gosh, can't you tell? Last night was so much fun. It was a short night. We did the corn maze and then we came back. And then after we came back, I watched Little Women and I, well, first I was really hungry. So I ordered McDonald's because I, I don't know, it was just everything else in Indianapolis was closed. I really wanted Chinese food, but nothing was open, literally nothing. Um, So I ordered McDonald's because that was like literally my only option. And then it canceled, the order canceled. So then I ordered Wendy's and then I ate that. <laughs> um, and then I went to bed and that's what you missed on Glee. I know this was a very short vlog, but you know, you guys know so much about me already. So what are you gonna do? <laughs> Thanks for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye everybody.